Over the past two decades, there has been a growing demand for autonomous exploration of subterranean environments ranging from tunnels, mines, and urban underground environments to complex cave networks. Simultaneous localization and mapping SLAM, in large-scale, unknown, and complex subterranean environments is a challenging problem. The environments are dark and feature-poor for visual systems and they pose challenges to LiDAR-based systems due to lack of distinguishable features and the high degree of symmetry in the environment. We present a multi-robot SLAM system called LAMP that enables robust and accurate subterranean mapping including an accurate LiDAR-based front-end and a flexible and robust back-end that automatically rejects outlying loop closures. The LiDAR front-end is in charge of using the raw LiDAR data to obtain relative pose measurements between consecutive robot poses, odometry, and non-consecutive poses, loop closures. Generalized ICP is used to first do scan-to-scan -scan odometry. A second step then corrects the odometry with a scan to submap point cloud alignment. New nodes are added to a pose graph after one meter of traverse. This builds up the pose graph for later pose graph optimization. Detecting and utilizing loop closures are critical to good performance. When returning to close a loop, nearby scans are checked as loop closure candidates. If the ICP fitness score is sufficient, a loop closure is accepted. Here, there is a substantial drift in the map which requires a loop closure to correct and give a successful map. This is another case where loop closure is important. In the long and straight experimental mine, the loop closure corrects a large amount of yaw drift. With large loops, there can be many incorrect loop closures. This makes outlier rejection critical. We use Incremental Consistency Maximization ICM, to reject back loop closures, which avoids the distortion in the map seen here. The multi-robot SLAM system enables a rapid exploration of an unknown environment. LAMP can combine the maps from multiple robots. Due to errors in initial alignment, here there is drift between the robots. This can be corrected with inter-robot loop closures. Inter-robot loop closures can be repeated as the robots continue to explore the unknown subterranean environment.